Kau tu lagi dari rumah lele. Ya, kau tu itu lagi dari. It's a chaos in here because I'm doing the last organizing before I'm going to film my makeup collection video. It annoys me that I won't be having all my stuff here, but that will never happen. So, <laughs> uh, but I'm organizing because uh, when I know I'm going to film, I'm more um, disciplined and I can finish my organizing like I want it. And I opened one drawer, drawer and I did not like how it looked, so now it's a mess. But I'm going to film this before and I'm so warm. I was just out with uh, Gunvald and it's so warm in Sweden. Um, we are both very... Gunvald is like... <laughs> but yeah, today is part three of my and Malin... My and Mal... <laughs> my, no. My, Malin and Linda's... Uh, yeah. I always want to say a free star series, but that we have already done. <laughs> uh, the UVS Clay series. And today uh, we're using the Masquerade palette. Woohoo! The palette that it all started with. I know it's not the first, but you know what I mean. Ooh. Did I get eyeshadow? No. Uh, this is, I have the big one. Um, and I have another palette that looks like a mess, but some palettes, they just leak oil. I hate it, especially my hamburger palette from Glamlight. But yeah, this is what the masquerade palette looks like. You all know it. And today we're going to do a two-toned look. So with one eye, on one eye, I'm only allowed to use these two rows to do a neutral look. And on the other eye, I have to use only these and they're only one matte. So, but that one is a matte with glitter, so I think we will be fine. So, a two tone look with this, just to show you how different you can do with this and neutral and whatever. So, let's put on some primer like that. God, I'm so warm. It is so warm, Gumal. Could you just drink glitter? Och du inte drick. Du har ditt vatten. Står inte bland sminket är du snäll. Nej, jag vet du är försiktig men jag håller på där står du. Så. Duktig. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned this in my other video. I don't think so. Have I recorded a video since I recorded that one? No, but I've done two makeup looks. It's so weird that I have done two makeup looks and not recorded. But yeah. Uh, I used my normal concealer on the eyelids and oh my god, my eyes they uh, ran. I don't know, but they water up and tears keep coming all day. So, and when my eyes do like that, the water goes up. What is that? and ruins the makeup and the concealer was the only thing that I did different on the lid um, so I guess um, my eyelids couldn't take it and when I felt them like this they burned and burned and it hurt so bad and at the end of the day I had no no eyeshadow left so there was I w were not able to you know see how the wear power were for that shadow look whatever uh, because the concealer just broke it down mm. so that's why we use our normal stuff and that's so weird because I've never had that happen I have sensitive skin but I use that concealer and I have used that concealer for years but as a concealer <laughs> uh, spot concealing and I have never had a problem at all so that was weird and I know it's not the eyeshadow because I've used that a million times, so, and not the mascara or anything. So that was the only thing I did different. Now I'm going to uh, put on my fan a bit and drink a bit, and then we can start doing the look. Like that. Okay, let's see. 
I think I'm going to start with the colorful eye because that, that's more fun. And let's take the matte. It's a purple and they are usually, mm, that we'll see, it's called, I don't know why I'm going to pronounce it because, but you know, Sobo. It looks like Hobo, but Sobo. So it's that shape. And I know all people that have um, oh, the big palettes, both this and the magic palette, are always saying, oh, I wish I bought the smaller one. I never feel that way. I I want the big palettes because I want more shadow and the, it was not like it was a lot more expensive. Nej. Nej, gummar. Gå ut på balkongen. Do you know how close it was that I put it on the other eye as well? Gå ut på balkongen. Gummal. Ut på balkongen. Du luktar så där. Men det står rätt. Gå ut där ute, gummal. Där. Var leksakerna? Gå ut där ute. Ja. Ja. Stå inte bland sminket. Ja, du kan ligga där. I don't remember what I was talking about. But I can tell you this purple, no, maybe it looks the same way, but it looked, I thought it looked darker in the pan, but yeah, now I'll put it on with that, now I'm going to shear it out a bit, it's just like you know with purples and blues and some shades, it's better to pack it on and then blend it out a bit, I don't want the purple to be that I want blue and pink, if we say it like that. I wonder, maybe I can try the pink and see, because it's a pink with gold glitter, and if I can remember, I don't think they translate it's that shade, and then that usually means that they are matte. Bory. Sounds like boring. Why would you name it like that? <laughs> and I'm actually going to try to not have foundation on today just powder because the last time when it was this warm um, and my eyes <laughs> were a mess it was so nice to not have a foundation to worry about let's see i don't think this is shimmy i can see some gold sparkles but not a lot what has happened here did i just get pink on my ear so weird to only do one eye. I always do my eyes at the same time. I could never understand how people could do one eye and then they uh, say I'm going to do the same on the other eye because I don't do you know a special order or anything. Sometimes you have to fix and then you have to fix on the other eye so you get the same and I don't I don't remember that. Like that, I like this a lot better. Uh, I was going to record this yesterday because this video is going up in like two hours. Uh, but I was going away yesterday to a place where I don't think, you know, it was, um, um, uh, what's it called, a barbecue uh, with all the people that are in the same bowling club as me. And I'm the only female and I'm like, I think there are three people that are younger than me. All the other people in that club are around 60. So I don't think a two-tone look would have gone by without comments there. Okay, let's see. Not that I care, but I was not in the mood to answer questions. So let's see. What shade do we want to use? I want to use the blue. Let's see how we're going to do this. Dahlia. 
So I'm using that one. Jag har egentligen slutat hyperventilera va? Packing it on and then I'm taking the edges and you know smashing them out, them out a bit. I have a plan. Like that. And now I'm going to take the other blue Zola. I'm pronouncing them wrong no, ma no matter what. No. Either way, so I can try not to say them at all because I don't think they will do much good to this video if I point. God, in my latest videos I have been so I've been talking about so many stupid things and I have not found the words um, and I just <laughs> get in a way like I don't want to finish this sentence but if I don't finish it I will have to cut it out. Do you know how much crap I cut out um, in my last video, you know the one that is called one, two, three, four, five. I was such a mess. I don't know what's wrong with me. And you probably don't have to spray these, but I always spray because I don't want so much fallout. I only want it to go up a little bit. In the other shade like that and I'm going to take Molly and I keep pronouncing it, um, the green one am I going to use all the shades well we didn't have to but it looks like it it's going to be a seat back on me I think I'm going to roll me I'm going to roll you can you sit there sit there come 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 Annars så kör jag på det förstår du. Ja. Klokt. It doesn't feel like this is that foiled like the others. But we'll see. Like that. That I like. I would have liked it more if I could have a blue crease, <laughs> but uh, you can't have it all. Now I'm going to try, let's see here. I'm just going to take, I'm just going to try here. Um, these are the types of shimmers that is a lot harder to work with in the crease because they are so foiled and moist that it's really hard to blend them out um, and they get patchy and you you will get them everywhere uh, other shimmers are much easier but I'm going to try because I don't have my makeup on and on and on yet I'm going to take that shade blue she she and I'm just going to dip my brush in it I just want to darken it up a little bit more here. Oh, that worked okay. But it's not like I will not. I know I will have to do that with some palette, but it's not easy to work with these in the crease if you think that you are going to do like you do with a matte. Maybe it will work for you, but usually it doesn't. You have to do a little bit different and use a little bit different brushes. But this worked fine. I'm going to take a little bit more of the blue dolly. Oh, I'm painting everything in here. My little plunt.
these colors go very well into each other. Like that. And now I'm going to take... Okay. Um, my... my Makeda, 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 I don't know, the purple shimmer. I will use all the shades. Good for me. I'm gonna take the same brush. Just, I don't want that super foiled finish with this shade. That's why I'm still using this fluffy brush. I want more like a blended look here. And you can get that with shimmers and so on, but it takes a lot more time. So, But that shade really made, just did exactly what I wanted it to do. I'm impressed. And let's take the pink again. And that's also because I put a shim, um, not a shimmer, a matte base underneath. If I hadn't done that, it would be even harder. On my eyelids, at least. Now I'm taking the Bore shade and then the Sobo shade here. I'm going to take the Sobo shade, the first shade I used. And put it under my eye. And then I will also put in the last shimmer there. feel like a peacock. Good thing I like them. I'm just tying this into that shade and then I'm going to take Calabar. I don't know. That shimmery shade. Same side, and I'm put, trying to put this closer to the eyes so that the mat are going further down than this. And I have some fallout here from the blue. This is because I love when it's a bit shimmery on the lower lash line, or not the lower lash line, but on. The lower lid. Why have I forgotten what that is called? On the under eye? I don't know. But I'm actually taking some in my waterline as well. Like that. And I'm going to take the green that we used before. I can find my brush. No, there it is. I have to clean my brushes. Yeah, and I'm going to take that in the inner corner as well. Vad gör du? Gummal. Hello. Sluta. Like that, and it can stay like that while we do the other eye. And I'm just going to clean my brushes and drink some more, and I'll be back. Now I'm back, and we are going to do a neutral eye. And here are, I think there are four mattes, and then we have one super foiled and two more normal shimmers. That is the type of shimmers that would be easier to have in the crease, but we already have four mattes, so I don't need that. And then we have that type of, um, like the pink, you know, it looks like it's a shimmer, but it's actually a matte with a lot of pressed gold, I think. Yeah, so 
that would also work. So it's kind of five mats. But yeah. So let's take take Burkina. Yeah, let's take that. I don't know if I will use all the shades here, but we'll start. Browns are usually not hard to work with and that's, you know, everyone makes brown, it's not a hard shade to make. But there are terrible brows, so it's not a guarantee. What is that? What are you doing? Do you want to go and put it on a card? Do you want to put it on a card? Jag ska inte gå någonstans. Nej, det ska jag inte. Inte när jag ser ut så här. Den. Den. I'm going to take Zulu. It's more like a reddish brown. Which I love. I think a lot of these will look kind of the same, but it looks like you're doing, you know, that the shapes are going into each other, but they still can make that gradient happen. So it's not all bad when you get, what is that? Shades that look like each other. What is that? But there is something on my lid. Let's hope it's nothing bad. It annoys me because it's giving me texture. But we'll see. Like that. And then I'm going to use Fulani. <laughs> that shade. It's the darkest shade. it looked like okay that's weird it looks like it, it looks like it's a really dark brown but when I put it on it's like no because that type of gradient I don't need that they are that similar but yeah no mind let's do like this I'm sorry, I have to see what that is. Wait. Now I'm just going back to the other shades. Um, because it's so fun when I talk about, oh, don't worry if the shades look very similar, you still get the gradient. And then I get shades that are very similar, but there is no gradient. Then they are too similar. Because they've used three different shades in different, um, uh, um, they are different, you know, one is light, one is dark and one is red and it's no different. So let's take the last dark red, that's a bit different, thank God. It's the Ada, I don't know. <sighs> is someone pronouncing this right? That, and then we have to clean up the other mess. I'm cleaning off my super fluffy brush and just blending a bit. I thought this side would be darker, but I'm guessing no. But never mind. Uh, let's take. I'm going to take Casablanca. Casablanca, that's that shade, the goldy 
mit Feuerlorn. These are usually very pretty as well, foiled golds. I'm taking it on the like three only I can't say that. If I would divide my lid into four parts, I'm covering three up. That's how you explain around. The fact that I don't know where it's gone. So I'm leaving a part here and a part here. Like that, that didn't need much. And I'm going to take <laughs> these two matte, no, matte shimmers that don't look that intense. Uh, just to see how they look. I'm going to take Giza in the inner part and that one in the outer part and I will see if I can mix it up a bit. Or am I going to take that? I start with Giza and then I see what I do. Let's see how this performs. Because I think I'm going to change my mind. Because these are not that they are shimmery, but it's not foiled like that. that. And I'm actually going to take, let's take that. I'm going to take Dahlia and I'm not going to spray it. It's not called Dahlia. There was another shade called that. It's called Dah, Dah, yeah. I'm just going to take it up here and I'm not going to spray it because I don't want it to be that intense. I just want the effect of it and that was a bit darker than I thought but never mind. I'm going to use all the shades. Yay! Then I'm going to take Cairo. The matte with shimmer under the eye. We'll see what we can do. Ooh, that looks really pretty. I love brown, red brown shades. Like that, and I'm going to take more of that shade up here on the part where I didn't take shimmer. And that part is not going to be that dark since there are no dark. It's, it's so weird that this is not a dark shade. You know, if you see this palette, it looks like those are dark shades. No. Maybe if we pack it on. Then it will have to look like it looks like that and then I'll we'll take a brush with nothing on it and I'm just going to take it out here I, I wanted to see if um, some shadow fell down because it usually does and I can see that it has um, so now I'm just blending a bit Okay, just got a message. I'm just blending the edges. Like that. Like that. Now I'm going to take um, my face on <laughs> and uh, mascara and everything and I will be back. It will probably take some time for me but you'll see me soon. <laughs> Bye. Now I'm back and I have used, I used this highlighter. I haven't used this before I don't think. It's from UVS Place, their baked highlighter in the Heroin Glow 2. I love the packaging. 
I mean, I'm not a big fan of the packaging, but I love the print on the packaging. And it looks like that, so it's the lightest of the two, and it's really pretty. It's like um, it's a peach highlighter. I love peach highlighter. It's so pretty. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a really pretty highlighter. I love it. Um, and on the lips, I have the, <laughs> the greatest, it's called greatest, <laughs> lipstick because I have it here. And it goes with most things, I think. So I took it on. And then I have uh, Colourpop uh, cream liners in Boots and Nut on the lower lash line. And I have... <laughs> I have... Um, when I went through my things, <laughs> I opened up a new mascara, and this is one of my old top three mascaras. It's from Body Shop, uh, Super Volume Mascara. I don't know, I think they still have it, because this, I have had this for a while, but I have not opened it, so the plastic were still around it. And I'm not used to it, because it takes a little bit longer to dry down. So, yeah, but I want to see if I still like it. Oh, it's so annoying. Don't I have anything to... Yeah, put on more. That will make it dry faster. But yeah. I like both sides really much. Um, and I have used all the shades in this palette. Ooh. So this is not just a two-toned look. It's uh, all the shades in a palette. <laughs> but it doesn't count because I've not used them. On the same eye but these two rows I have here and these two rows I have here so you can make really pretty neutral looks and really pretty colorful looks oh no oh I just got a little bit on me yeah I'm a mess but uh, this was round three in uh, my Marlin and Linda's um, UVS Play series. I hope you like it. Next week, I think it's the Sahara. And uh, and now I'm going back to. Uh, well, I will edit this first because this is probably going up in an hour, uh, and then I will uh, continue organizing. But yeah, so I like it. I would have liked to have either that look on both eyes or that look on both eyes because if I'm going out now I, I will be a bit self-conscious um, because they are so totally different but I really like both of them it's my type of neutral look I like it so yeah go watch Linda and Malin I have not talked about them a lot in this video but I feel like I can't do that in every video we are doing a collab because then you will get tired of me not tired of them because you can't get tired of them but I will be saying the same thing and we do collab so often but I really hope by now that you have checked them out and um, let's see if we can make Linda uh, reach 100 subscribers uh, I have not checked right now um, how much is left but uh, I don't think she has come over 100 subscribers so let's do that um, yeah, and I have no foundation on. I don't know what I like about it because I get so red here. I'm not used to that. I don't mind seeing my freckles, but I mind being red. But yeah, I just have powders and all the other stuff. I never thought I'd be a person that didn't have foundation on. But I really like it so far. Yeah, stop talking. Uh, we'll see you soon. Bye.